Hey guys, um, I hope everyone is doing well. So I have a prophetic word, right, for the continent of Europe. Europe, Europe, Europe. Um, but yeah, yeah, let me pray real quick before I, before I even go into that word. Father God, I thank you for another day, another opportunity to to be your mouthpiece, to be your your vessel to your people. Father God, I thank you. I'm honored. It's a privilege to be used by you, O oh God. Father God, I pray that you will bring greater insight as this word is being spoken. Father God, let the words of my mouth, let the meditation of my heart be acceptable in your sight in this moment. Yes, Father God, I pray that you will even cover the airway even now, cover the ears, the mind, and the hearts of the listeners even now, so they can only hear you in this moment, Father God. Fine tune their hearing, fine tune their reception, oh God, and they their 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 understanding in this moment in the name of Jesus. We pray. Amen. Amen. So um so like I told you guys, I'm like when I was not making videos, I was actually, you know, in some time praying i took like i think those this was on june 10th um i was just praying led by the holy spirit to just pray for like the continents right the different continents um and as i you know as i was about to pray <laughs> for europe i didn't even say a word about of prayer yet i heard um the holy spirit the, I, I hear the lord said you have been very silent these days europe your silence does not hide your sin, Europe. And then as I can, and then, <laughs> so that, I, when he said that to me, I started to pray and just go deep and say, Father God, have your way. Um, um, have that own way, O oh Lord, in this moment. And then I immediately in the spirit, I saw an egg, right? I saw an egg being cracked. So it's like in the spirit, what I saw was just like the, a map or a globe. And I saw the continent of of Europe was there and the egg was just cracked on the continent of Europe. And then when the egg was cracked, I heard the Lord said, your sins are, your secrets are about to hatch. And then when I look close, your secrets are about to hatch. And then when I look closer in the egg, right, it's like I saw like, like a baby chicken was already being formed, but it was in like an embryo state. And then the Holy Spirit said to me, it was just that your before your secrets can come to fruition, your secret plans, your your your, your secret deals, before they can come to fr fruition, they will be exposed. They're about to hatch early. It's like it's hatching early. It's about to be exposed early. It's like God is not going to allow you to complete whatever secret plans you have going on. Um, and this is for like, you know, the, the, the government and, and those who are in power. This is straight up a word for the political um, leadership, the governmental leadership in the continent. Um, so I should have clarified that first. So the Lord said that, you know, your secrets are about to be atched. Your secrets are about to be atched. And before they could even, you know, come to fruition or be complete, they're about to be atched. Europe has been quiet because they're talking in the secret. That's what the Lord said. Europe has been quiet because they're talking in the secret. They're planning in the secret. You will not escape the righteousness and the judgment of the Lord. That's what the Lord said. He said, you will not escape the righteousness and the judgment of the Lord. Though you are quiet, though you're moving in secret, my eyes are upon you. My eyes see everything. I will not blink, said the Lord, for I am watching you with vigilancy. I'm watching you without blinking. I'm watching you without slumbering. I'm watching you without wavering. I am the God that watched. Watch. Watches. Um... And one of the things that the Lord said to me, he said, I've heard the cry of my righteous people in, 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 um, Europe and it's, and it's on behalf of them. I have come to bring their deliverance. And then what the Lord started to show me was just right. Like the cry and the prayer of the righteous is like, 
the, it was blocked. It's like I felt what the Lord said to me is just like, and the Lord allowed me to feel that intercessors in Europe and people who in Europe who intercede on behalf of the, the continent, they are, are they have become weary because they feel like their prayer for the continent or the prayer for their community is not going anywhere. It's stagnant. And what I saw in the spirit was that there was a glass shield over um the continent of europe and it, the glass shield was specifically was to hold down the the prayers of the intercessors especially prayers concerning the continent concerning communities and stuff like that it, that shield was assigned to to suppress those prayers but then what i saw in the spirit was just that there was an angel that came down with a sword and cut the glass shield open when they cut the glass shield open it was just like you heard like a loud Burst. It sounded like, at, well, first time I heard it, it just sounded like a loud shout, like a loud scream. But like within those scream were the different prayers of people that were backed up. So it's just like it just flooded out. So it's just like it was. It literally just came. It was like such a loud, and and I saw the words just flying past me when I was in this vision. The words, the prayers that people had backed up. But one thing I noticed was that when the angel cut the glass seal open at first, it looked like a glass seal. It looked at hard at first, but when the angel put the sword and cut it open, it's then it looked like a just a clear embryo. So I'm not really sure what that means yet. I hope that will reveal that to me why why it was an embryo or or um hmm. Oh, the Lord just said to me, those are prayers that are not that weren't birthed. So you know, like when 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 something is still not so when like a, what I'm getting this was like I'm seeing a baby in a womb, the baby's not the baby having been birthed yet, so it's in an embryo. So those prayer you know they're there but they weren't birthed because you know they were they were being constrained and what could have happened was like a miscarriage so to speak that prayer would have like it, i don't know how to explain what i'm seeing in this verse it's like like that prayer it was like it would have been a miscarriage like the more the, the longer that those prayers would have remained constrained um it's like it would have just died by the wayside is that what I'm, is that, that's what I'm seeing in the spirit. But the Lord said, I have removed it. And then, then when I saw that, I didn't understand it. But then when the Lord said to me, um, I have removed the restraint of the principalities um, from your prayers, the restraints, the restraints of the principalities. And then that's when the Lord said to show me that the principalities in, in Europe, they had put a strain on prayers concerning communities, concerning the continent. So that's as intercessors who pray on behalf of the continent of Europe. And you may feel like the prayer just feels stagnant or there's a heaviness when you're praying or you just don't feel like, yo, this is going anywhere. That's the spiritual reason behind it, what, what, what God was showing me. And then after that, you know, the Lord said to me, my judgment and verdict is here. I hear the Lord said, you know, I'm serving judgment and verdict to the continent of Europe. Then I saw the Lord wave his hand across the Europe. So it's just like I saw a vision of the globe, the map, and then there was a continent of Europe and the Lord waved his hand over Europe. But it was in such a way like he's saying, peekaboo, I see you. And then I heard the Lord said, you, you're you not hidden. Your deeds are not hidden. So the Lord is definitely, you know, I think what the Lord is saying that there is some exposure that he's bringing to the continent of Europe. And he's also bringing judgment and he's also bringing verdict. And he's also disrupting the secret plans of the enemy, the secret plans of the occult, the secret plans of those who are the, the unbelievers and those who are in power. Um, he's disrupting their plan before it could even come to fruition. The Lord is not going to allow the, um, the ungodly things that are going on in the land to be silenced anymore. Um, one of the things that the Lord sh showed me was that he was stirring the pot. I, I saw a provoking that's coming to the continent of Europe that, you know, there are some things that are going to be provoked, you know, like, um, like an uproar or, or like something, but there's something's going to be a prov how the reason what I'm seeing, what I'm seeing is there's a group of people just, um, what do you call that? 
when they're, lo I guess, lobbying, they're standing up with signs and stuff like that. There's something provoked. There's something that's going to be, that's the, the word. That's what I'm feeling. That's what I'm seeing in the spirit. That's what the Lord is saying to me. That there's a provoke. There's a provoke. But then I saw the hand of the Lord stirring a pot. And God said that he's stirring the pot. But he was stirring the pot very strategically. He was scooping up the, the things from the bottom and it's bringing it up to the top. So like he's stirring the pot. He's bringing the bottom to the top. That's what the Lord said. Mm. Hallelujah. Father God, is there anything else? I'm trying to look at my notes. And I'm also going to be releasing the prayer because those prayers that I was praying about the continent, I just, you know, I record, I recorded them. So I'm eventually going to release them as a part of like my prayer list thing that I have going on. So I feel like what I'm going to do is like after I release a prophetic word for a continent, I'm going to release that prophetic prayer afterwards. So if there's anything that I didn't take from the note, you know, the prayer can fill that in. Because what I did was after I prayed that prophetic prayer and I was so deep in the spirit when I came out I re-listened it and I started taking notes but um yeah let's let's keep up let's keep let's watch and pray when it comes to Europe let's watch and pray when it comes to Europe the Lord is about to do some some stirring in Europe oh the Lord just reminded me of this and I see I didn't even write it down but it was I'm sure it's in the prayer recording I saw something about the royal family in the news in Europe, there's an attention. I saw attention being pointed to the royal family and specifically the queen. Um, I saw attention being appointed to the royal family and specifically the queen. And, and I saw that this would be in the news as well. There, there's, a, there's, there's, there's some attention. There's something that has to do with the royal family. Um, I didn't write that down, but I'm sure it's going to be in the prayer. So if, when you listen to the prayer, you will get that part too. But he just brought it. Oh, I wrote it on right here. Um, what is what is silent will now be known. And then I see and I see attention going to the royal family, specifically the queen. Oh, I wrote down the same thing I just said. So um, yes, yeah, so let's keep an eye on Europe. Let's watch and pray. Let's watch and pray when it comes to Europe. Uh, Father God, we just thank you. We glorify you in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, guys, take care.